it's Nicole here. Today I wanted to discuss something a little bit different. A lot of us just like to brush this kind of topic along, you know, just just off to the side and just not even think about that. Even my own self, when I've had self-doubt issues, uh, myself even when asking a doctor, for example, they would just tell me it was just part of being a woman. It's kind of a, a bullshit um, answer, in my opinion. Mental health awareness is such a huge, import, important topic. And you know what? A lot of people just don't want to discuss it. And this is just something that can cause so many physical ailments as well. And time after time, it just, it just gets thrown under the rug. So many women out there with anxiety, depression, self-doubt, confidence issues. And it's, it's just staggering. It's, it's just craziness. These things just need to be discussed more. It's not something to just be thrown under a rug and just being told, hey, you have to deal with that. We all get compared to these high standards on the internet, Instagram, these beautiful models that are getting touched up, photoshopped. It's just craziness, you know? We get barbarized all the time with these things. It's no wonder that we have self-doubt at times for some of these things. I myself have this problem as well. Um, but I will tell you, through fitness, that has helped me change my mindset inside and out. And that's why I created Empower Fitness, because of my story. I wanted to help women and support them on a regular basis to help with these principles. I wanted to be that helping hand, be like, you know what, you can do this. It's not just about losing weight. That is just one tiny factor of the equation. At the end of the day, it comes down to how you feel about yourself. Because that, you know, feeling bad about yourself, anxiety, depression, self-doubt. When you're feeling down in the dirt, nothing is gonna, nothing's going to work. It's just everything's going to be working against you. But when you're able to push that aside and have an amazing mindset, that you will be able to do anything, put your mind to it, you completely are free. So when I was in my early 20s, I was in a horrible car accident, which um, left me in a pretty crappy position. Um, I, I was pretty immobile for a while. I broke a bunch of bones. Um, I was told I actually wouldn't be able to ride horses ever again, which is one of my passions. I've been just taking a, a little break right now. And, uh, and I would have to seek other ways to actually do what I wanted to do for the regular for the rest of my life but through the course of fitness and actually looking into myself where I wanted to be and where I was right now and being like you know what I'm not going to be stuck for the rest of my life I'm only 22 years old I'm not going to lay down and die I'm not it was just it was just way too much I wasn't going to stay down in the dust for that and by working out, every time I worked out, I felt better and better about myself. I could see the results day in and day out, inside and out. And with that, it's just, it's just such an amazing feeling. I, I knew I had to share this amazing passion I had with women, you know, to feel amazing inside and out for themselves. So I, helped, I aim to help women be that hand, you know, come in. Feel great about yourself. Let's get fit and have a lot of fun. Feel amazing about themselves during the actual journey. Have an amazing mindset with, with a proper nutrition and a banging workout. That's all you really need. And, and, you know, plenty of fun, you know. So if any of this resonates with you, feel free to share your story as well. And if you feel this story might help others, feel free to share it as well. Remember... Um, it's just not something you have to, you know, to, to feel alone anymore. You don't. Definitely speak out. And uh, I'm here for you. And uh, have a beautiful day.